Yo, K2SG Henny, K2SG 20. This song called JT. K2SG, so, so, uh, the rated in my city, man. I don't think we in the era where niggas giving a fuck about bars right now. They'll probably give a fuck about bars later on or eventually. But I don't think, I don't think, uh, like, bars is underappreciated, man. So I feel like that's the reason why K2SG not getting looked at the way I look at them. Because nowadays we living in an era where bars don't really matter. You can kind of tell based off who kind of popping right now. And I ain't talking about my city. I'm talking about the world. Like, if you look, it's a lot of, like, catchy songs like Corvette, Corvette and um, stuff like that. That's not lyrical. You know what I'm saying? That's more like party songs and dance songs. So when, when, the, when, the, when, the, when the culture shift and they come back around to, like, the lyrical shit, like how it is when Kendrick and Wale and Big Sean and them, I feel like they're going to have that lane again, like, to step right into it and be like, okay, lyricism is back for real. Hey, hold on real quick. But yeah, I'm back. Anyway, I feel like, like I said, I feel like lyrical music ain't it right now. I feel like the labels want the niggas who know how to make them fucking catchy songs that go on TikTok and shit. And I respect how K2SG, every member of K2SG is sticking to their roots and they focusing on just making dope ass music rather than trying to make something for TikTok, you know what I'm saying? Or or making something for a dance, you know? But I respect the people who are doing that shit too because they get into their money and they sticking to their roots too. I respect anybody sticking to their roots. This is not a shot at nobody. I was just thinking about how the biggest song in the world right now is the Corvette Corvette song. And songs like this kind of underappreciated. And this is like more valuable than the Corvette Corvette type of songs. But uh, yeah, man, we're going to get straight into this video. I already talked a lot, so I'm going to just chill. But I'm I'm definitely going to be breaking down them bars. So don't think I ain't going to dissect the lyrics. For show. Damn, BT. What's up? I thought them was black forces. I was gonna say, my man's on that black forces activity. Look at all them hundreds and twenties. I see fifties, twenties, hundreds. I don't see no fives. I think I see one five dollar bill. No, I don't. That's a fifty. My fault. Yeah, fifties, twenties, and hundreds. What Boosie say? If you, he said, if you see a fifty, I'm pussy, nigga. If you see a ten, I'm pussy, nigga. If you see a 10 on pussy, I don't, for real though, like I really don't see no 10s. I see 50s, 20s, 100s. That's crazy. Before. Hey. I ain't never had none of them. I had the original Hennessy. I don't know if it's a difference, but I had the clear bottle. You know, the, uh, the clear one that's uh, shaped like a square. That's the one. That's the last ones I had. I don't drink no more. But, uh, yeah, they, they had the liquor store with it. Before I bought me a safe, I hit my stash in the vacant. Trapping with no heat, but still growing in the basement. Cooking in the kitchen, stretching grannies out of babies. I'd be a millionaire if I was this age in the 80s. Man, damn, I missed the block. Been reminiscing about it lately. Fiends knocking, had them foaming at the mouth like they got rabies. Niggas throwing shots, but I could never let them phase me. And shit, I don't blame you. If I was you, I'd hate me. Some of my niggas see me shining, and tried to shame me. If you my nigga, you... They need a fucking Hennessy sp- uh, sponsorship. For those who don't know, that's why Henny go by Henny, man. They need a sponsorship. They need to get paid by Hennessy, man. They giving Hennessy too many fucking uh free promo, man. If this video hit 100 million views, Hennessy will be getting hella money off them niggas. You know better than a fame me first. 
the Hennessy wouldn't even be paying them niggas shit. Hey, that's uh, that's peso, I think. He ain't on the north, but that nigga look like little baby. <laughs> That nigga look just like Lil Bibby, bro. I'm a south side baby growing up next to them tracks. It'll make you go crazy, for real. Niggas think they unlucky. No, nigga, you lazy. Every minute count for something because none of it ain't free. I won't feel accomplished till I'm in meetings with Jay-Z. Hey, look, we, we, not finna, we, not finna, we not finna skip past that. Two of the most lyrical niggas right there, bro. Pimo and Twenty. Hey, y'all know them versus battles niggas be talking about Two Chains versus Rick Ross, Jeezy and Gucci, Keisha Cole, Ashanti. I want to see Twenty and Pimo. Twenty and Pimo versus, but only based off of their verses, not not whole songs. Just based. I mean, they can go song for song, but it's about the lyricism because them two, they two lyrical dudes on a whole nother level. Like them two in a versus for me crazy. Push till I'm in me is with Jay Z. Till then I'm doing donuts in the Daytona with JT. I need a gangster chocolate bitch real freaky like JT. But I love that part of the song. That's the uh, only part of the song I know. This video been out for about a week or so, and I've been seeing snippets on social media. But yeah, that's the only part I heard because I be y'all know me when I see some shit. I go right past it because I ain't trying to get nothing. I ain't trying to hit nothing before it drop. Boy still on the block with them Glocks like, like JB. Huh? This grocery prices nigga come shop, but it ain't cheap. You nah. be beating on your bitch because she mad that you ain't me. Me and my bitch fuck hoes together. I can't cheat. Boy, I know. Goals. That's a real goal. I would love to live, I would love to live that life. You was a bitch, you to stay on the same street. Only rapper can do three different flows on the same beat. Bro, go on rapper stoke get you blow with the same heat. Bro, go on rapper stoke get you blow with the same heat. I was gonna say this song over already. Bro, so uh, FTM chain. I don't see. I don't know if Bear in this video. I don't see him. It might be somebody else. I think it's the dude with the fro. Bro, go on, rubbers, you blow the A, and I can't even trust people because niggas be such. Yeah, the nigga with the poor and FTM chain. Not aware of who he is, but uh, shout out to him. That chain was icy as fuck. I just dropped another ban on investments like fuck clothes. Heard them niggas on the sub. See, that's the shit that I be talking about. I just dropped another ban on investments like fuck clothes. Bro. I wear the same shit, regular t-shirt, shout out to fam over. I wear regular shit, man. Clothes can fucking wait, bro. I'm trying to build some shit that's gonna last way beyond the outfit. Got more snow than the North Pole. I don't even like the talk, he be speaking in Morse code. I read the Minaj with four hoes, let hoes get your goals. 400 on my- Minaj with four hoes? Man. That, that's, that's, that's one of my dreams. My back 650 for these souls. 25 a jar, 36 for these bows. I was putting niggas on before they start hitting them stuff. Kids are hot niggas, dick ride, they never hit no hoes. Prices niggas quote, you ain't never flip no low. He said, You can tell how niggas dick ride, they ain't never hit no hoes. That means like they don't like girls, they dick ride so much, they ain't never, they don't fuck with pussy. You get what I'm saying? That, that was a bar. I like how they going back and forth, and I like how they. It's almost like they picking up where they left off. It's almost like uh, it's like basketball. Every time I throw the ball, my teammate should catch it. If he don't catch it, he bullshitting. They catching the ball every time they throw it towards each other. Me and bro just bust a nut on that bitch that you kissed on. I'd be pissed if I do dirt with a nigga get snitched on. Niggas try to cut his. I'd be pissed too. Man, you break the law together. And you telling me it's like, bro, we planned this out, man. You sat down and strategically planned this out. Shit went left, and you told on me, bro. What kind of shit is that? Go off with this bitch, play this song. I walk a nigga down before I write a diss song. Niggas gang the same niggas that used to respect that. I walk a nigga down before I do a diss song. Cause listen, I know I'm pausing the life. Y'all want to hear the real song without my interruptions? Go look the shit up, man. It's on YouTube. The same place y'all found my video, y'all found that y'all can find that bitch on YouTube. But look, um, 
th this song's only going to leave evidence for when some shit happened. If a nigga diss me in a song and I, and I did some back and then I get something done to him, them diss songs is leaving clues and evidence about basically what I just did to him. Versus if he diss me and I don't say nothing, I don't speak on it, I don't say nothing, and then next thing you know, he in the hospital because he got beat up or jumped or robbed or killed or whatever the fuck happened to the man. I ain't leave no paper trail. To get picked on, they been waiting on my return, they mad it took me this long. I pick her up, beat her down, make her take a lift home. Soon as bro give me that- Oh, uh, what do you say? They mad it took me this long. I pick her up, beat her down, make her take a lift home. Soon as bro get- Gank the same niggas that used to get picked on. They been waiting on my return, they mad it took me- Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. When this song came out, I'm like, damn, this got Henny on it. I ain't did a Henny song in a minute. I think the last Henny song I did, I think he was wearing like a baseball jersey in the video. This long. I pick her up, beat her down, make her take a lift home. Soon as bro give me that sauce, I'ma punch to my fist swallow. They do you dirty, they look at you like they ain't do shit wrong. Niggas think we ain't been getting money, now that big Chris gone. social media i'm gonna leave that on the screen so y'all can uh go tap in but look shout out to henny shout out to 20 Henny and 20 i made a video like three years ago saying that they needed to do a project together so call that bitch 20 shots of henny or some shit like that Tw yeah 20 shots of henny i think that's what i said in the last video anyway i don't know if this song because they don't say featuring they say henny x20 which is and so henny and 20 so i don't know if this is because they got a project coming together or if it's henny song because henny name is first and you know whoever name is first that's usually who people just automatically get a song to oh it's his song because his name was first but it don't say featuring 20 so it's their song and i don't know if this is because they got some shit in the works or if they just want to just give something to the people that rock with their music like me but uh yeah I hope y'all enjoyed this video, K2SG20, K2SG Henny. If y'all want to hear the original video without my commentary, go look that shit up, man. Stop complaining because I talk so much. That's what y'all That's what y'all want me to react to this bitch for. Y'all, the viewers, want me to react to this motherfucker because my commentary, man. And I love doing this shit for y'all, so I'm going to keep doing this shit for y'all.